Time now for A to Z 60, where we celebrate the people, places, and things that make the Valley awesome in just 60 seconds. And this morning, we're talking about Arizona's rich military history. Team 12's Jamie Cagle takes us to the Mesa Museum, where that history still goes airborne. There's a place right here in the Valley where you can get up close and personal with generations of military aircraft. It's right here at Air Base, Arizona. The museum houses some of the rarest planes of the world from World War I all the way to the Vietnam War, including six World War II planes restored to flying status. And the best part here is you can do more than just look. We can actually buy tours to go inside the aircraft themselves, and there's three of them that we actually can take you on board any day they don't happen to be flying. Ever dream of flying one of these beauties? They can actually put their hands on the control stick, their left hand on the throttle, their feet on the rudder pedals. We talk about what the switches are and what actually happens, all along with a little bit of what the actual pilot would have gone through in a, in a typical mission. If you really want to dive into history, how about flying over the valley in the cockpit of the nimble T-6 Texan? If being a passenger is more your style, you'll want to step aboard the C-47. Ever wonder what it's like to be a bombardier or gunner? Then you'll want to reserve your seat on the B-17 or the B-25 bomber. And that's your A to Z 60. This isn't exactly your 747, but then again, 747s don't have hardware like this. That is pretty impressive. In addition to all the aircraft, there's also an actual piece of the USS Arizona on display at the museum. And they do do summer camps for kids. There you go. You got something now. Yes. For their location, hours, and tickets, just visit their website, azcaf.org.